Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Julia and for today's video I am inspired by Alexa Chung's 5 outfits in 5 minutes video. I absolutely loved this video. She had a little itinerary of 5 different places that she needed to go and um, she styled her outfits in under 5 minutes. So I have a bunch of clothes to look through. I haven't really um, I just grabbed some random pieces that I really enjoy. I haven't really looked through them and I wrote my itinerary after I got my outfits. So I'm giving myself five minutes to style these outfits and without further ado, let's just get into it. So I have all of these clothing items and then some accessories plus shoes. Oh. Alrighty guys, so I have my itinerary right here. First on the list is going to the airport. Second is shopping around New York. Third is the beach day at the Hamptons. Fourth is brunch with the gals. And then number five is a dinner in Paris. So, I'm giving myself five minutes, I got a timer running, and I'm going to try to style all these outfits beginning with the airport. Alrighty, airport outfit, airport outfit. Something a little bit more casual, comfortable, don't have to dress it down too much. I really didn't even grab anything comfortable. Okay, I have this white um, cropped t-shirt, kind of a fitted t-shirt, I could wear that. And, ooh, this would be cute. I have these um, long striped uh, pants. I don't know, they're almost paper bag style. I could go with those. And then probably some sunnies to kind of hide my face, especially if I'm not wearing makeup at this supposed airport that I'm definitely not going to right now. <laughs> and then some sneakers. I have these white Tommy sneakers. So I'm gonna go put this on and I'll get back with you in a second. and casual but I also feel like I'm pretty dressed up so like I said I have these paper bag pants they're really comfortable they're not too like tight or anything and they have like just a cropped ankle a little cut off at the ankle and then just this white I'm out of breath <laughs> I have this white um, cropped t-shirt and then just some sunnies because when you're at the airport, usually you're not wearing too much makeup, if at all. <laughs> and then just these white Tommy sneakers. I think this outfit turned out really well. But that also means if I spent two minutes on an outfit, <laughs> I don't even have a minute per outfit on these next ones. So let's hope I can get this next one rolling a little bit quicker. Okay. So number two on the agenda is shopping around New York. Honestly, Southfield would be pretty good for that. But challenge myself, try some other things. Okay, so I have like 30 seconds to do this. Oh, I should probably actually wear these tennies. I have these other paper bag pants, nice pattern on them. I'll go with that. And... Mm, Ooh, this could be cute. Is that weird or cute? Mm. This cowl neck, I could try that. Ooh, oh, that's 
pattern on pattern though. <laughs> I feel more cash. Oh my goodness, I'm taking way too much time. Okay, let's just try this. I have some pants and a straight neck tee or tank. Let me go try it on. outfit but it's not the worst thing ever I mean it's all right I feel like I could have done better with a different top but I don't really have anything cute to go with these pants <sighs> but I have these really cute patterned pants I'll show you them they're a nice paper bag style I really enjoy those honestly I think that the other shirt would have looked better with this that I was wearing before. I'm going to go try it on and see if this looks better with this outfit because I'm not digging this straight tank top. Alrighty. Well, I definitely like that better. I could definitely see myself shopping around town in this. New York, I don't know. I might. <laughs> this might be a little casual for New York, but I wore the same Tommy. It's just because if you're walking around all day, I don't think heels are the best option. And then, like I said, these pants, which I really enjoy. I just think that this top looks a little bit better than the straight neckline tank. But I mean, this isn't the worst thing. I definitely wish I could have spent a little bit more time on it. But I have a whole nother outfit to go for. Number three is Beach Day at the Hamptons, which I already know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do these cute little pants and then probably, ooh, I have two pairs of shorts, don't I? Mm, okay, I'm going with this one. Some shorts and this little cardigan because I get cold out in the water. And a little floppy hat for, yeah. <laughs> floppy hat and just some like kitten heel sandals let me put those on for ya I mean <laughs> I do really enjoy these shorts more but I didn't have anything cute to put with them but these are definitely a beach day short if I've ever seen one so I just have this fluffy cardigan because I mean realistically I would be wearing a bathing suit under here and then just some cute washed out denim, these shoes, and then a floppy hat. Not the worst look. I think number two is my least favorite thus far. Ooh, this would have been cute with it instead on my head. But that's okay. Whew. Not the worst. Alrighty, now number four, I don't know what this is. Look number four is a brunch day with the gals. Alrighty, so I have this cute little jump sh jumpsuit, excuse me. I think that would be cute with maybe these snake skin. Going a little dressy with the gals, but they just have to understand. And maybe this little headscarf. Okay, let's try it. so tall and out of 
I don't know what to do with this little scarf that I have. Let me see. This is some interesting patterns that I have going. <laughs> I mean, that could be cute. Just in a little bow. Does that look awful? I mean, it's not my favorite thing. <laughs> but this look felt so dull and boring without anything pattern. So I have this jumpsuit. I'm so tall in these heels. They're a snakeskin boot heel. And then this little headscarf that I tied, which I don't really love this. Maybe just like that. Oh, that's better. Alrighty, I could get down with that. I don't love the heels with this, but it's not... <laughs> I feel like none of these outfits I'm in love with, but that's okay. I'm also wearing the wrong bra for all of these outfits. But, I mean, it's not the worst thing imaginable. Alrighty, so we have one more place to go. Let me just not be as tall, which is whew, uh, dinner in Paris, which I saw this skirt earlier and I've been saving it for this look. I think this would be the perfect Paris skirt with <laughs> maybe a sweater. I feel like I'd be eating on the terrace outside, so maybe a sweater would be a good idea. And then I'm going to go with the same kitten heels as before. Let's go put this on. This is my least favorite one of them all. Oh, can I recover this? Oh no, I hate it. <laughs> you know when you have a great idea in your head and then it just goes horribly, horribly wrong. The skirt isn't bad, but it's the sweater. Let me try on a different shirt with this and try to recover this outfit. I have this one that I haven't used either. Just the silky top. Let me try this on and see if this is any better because I kind of hate this sweater with this. Okay, I feel like this is definitely a lot better. I also feel like I look like a suburban mom, but we're going to ignore that. I definitely love this skirt. It's a little bit big on me. I need to sew it, but I love, love, love this skirt. I think it's the perfect Paris night skirt. And then I just have this silky blouse that I like a lot better. And then the same kitten heels. I mean, it's not the I keep saying that with every outfit. It's not the worst one, but I think they're all pretty mediocre at best. So I'm going to change back into my everyday clothes or what I was wearing and um, decompress about how this went. Actually, I might change into something else because I really liked one of these outfits. I'll be back and not timed anymore for this. I've just made a mess. Alrighty. This was my favorite outfit <laughs> of them all. This are my paper bag pants, the other ones that I had. But, oh, that was quite loud. If I learned anything through this, I think it's that um, I'm not good at styling outfits quickly. 
Um, I think I my time was just a little bit over five minutes. I'll have to check. But, um, yeah. I thought I had a lot of great pieces and a lot of, like, neutral pieces that can match really well with each other. And a lot of, these are all my favorite pieces that I like to cycle through. But truth told is that uh, I'm not good under pressure. Um... A lot of pieces that like I'm looking at now like oh wait that would have been cuter I had this cute little blazer that just got left behind that would have been adorable for something but if I've learned anything today it's that I should take my time styling my outfits because I think I can do pretty good um, when I'm not on a time constraint but when I am I don't think that this itinerary life is the life for me well, thank you guys for watching regardless of how well or how poorly this went. I think it's a really fun thing to do, especially because most of us aren't going out right now. I think it's kind of fun to play a little dress up. <laughs> I actually love this hat. Um, but if you guys liked, please make sure to like and subscribe for more. And I will be back next week with something new. <laughs> Who knows? Thank you guys. Have a good one. Bye.